Suspected loan sharks poured petrol and set a blaze to a house gate over a supposed 620 ringgit loan with 200,000 ringgit in compound interest. 62-year-old Cho Haid Gai said she was rudely awakened to the smell of petrol outside her home around 1 a.m. on Saturday. She found out that her gate was torched. It all began when her son, who works in Singapore, was offered a loan of 200 Singapore dollars or 620 ringgit through an internet scam some time ago. Ask a detail, I think the inside maybe ask some detail. And On, I said, online one, the uh, online, 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 online And I sent 200 to him, the first Singapore dollars. 200, oh. the first time. Singapore? Singapore dollar, 200. Well, the son working in Singapore. So when was this? On the 9th. Okay. And then uh, he, he, he received the 200 Singapore dollar and then okay. he fund. They fund to the Alo. Now he got washed up here and they fund the money. Okay. I don't want the money. Well, you don't want the money, you want to get back? La? I get back, man. He's washed up here. Man. You're not satisfied? La, I'm not satisfied. Well, he, he said did. once taken, cannot give back? Ah. Right. And then after that, the Alo asked for 400 Singapore dollar. Your son gave back? Your son gave back? Ah? 200. Give back, give back. How? Give, I can't remember. Uh, how? I, can't, I think so. I don't know because my son just told me like that. Okay. Uh, he pay back 200 and then they asked for 400 okay. Singapore dollar. And then they asked for two, 2000. Uh, 2000. 2000 first. Oh. After that, they asked for 20,000. <laughs> now 200,000. <laughs> all in Singapore. All this uh, happened uh, in Singapore. Singapore. Uh, yes. The fiery footage was sent to Cho's daughter as a warning. Cho has since lodged a report at the Georgetown District Police Station and wants the police to investigate.